Selecting the right color palette for your home is more than just picking shades you love. It's about crafting an ambience that harmonizes with traditional decor, enhancing both the aesthetic appeal and the emotional resonance of your living spaces. When imbued with the richness of traditional design, color not only decorates but also deepens the narrative of your home. Here are seven authoritative ideas to guide you in choosing the perfect traditional decor color palette for your home. Embracing historical accuracy in your traditional decor color palette is not just about selecting colors, it's about weaving a narrative that pays homage to the rich tapestry of the past. This approach requires a thoughtful examination of the eras and styles that inspire your decor, delving into the specific hues that define those times. Here's how you can achieve historical accuracy with depth and intention. Research and Inspiration Begin with thorough research into the historical period that inspires your decor. Whether your home leans towards the opulent richness of the Victorian era, the understated elegance of Georgian style, or the intricate patterns of the Baroque period, understanding the color schemes prevalent during these times is crucial. Libraries, museums, and historical archives can offer invaluable insights into the authentic colors used in historical interiors. Moreover, studying artworks, fabric swatches, and architectural elements from the period can provide a deeper understanding of how colors were combined and utilized. Authentic Color Palettes Once you have a solid understanding of the era, focus on identifying authentic color palettes that resonate with that period. For instance, the Victorian era favored deep, rich tones such as burgundy, emerald green, and navy blue, reflecting the period's love for opulence and depth. The Georgian period, on the other hand, saw the use of lighter, more airy colors like sage green, sky blue, and soft yellows, mirroring its emphasis on clarity and light. These authentic palettes serve as a foundation for your decor, ensuring that every color choice is steeped in historical significance. Modern Interpretations While historical accuracy is paramount, integrating these colors into a modern home requires a balance between authenticity and contemporary living. Consider modern interpretations of historical colors that might be more suited to today's lighting and architectural styles. Many paint manufacturers offer historically inspired collections that have been adjusted for contemporary interiors, providing a bridge between the past and present. This approach allows you to maintain a connection to the historical palette while ensuring the colors look vibrant and true in your home-specific context. Textural Context Historical accuracy also extends to the textures and materials used alongside your color palette. Traditional decor often involves a variety of textures, from the plushness of velvet upholstery to the smoothness of polished wood. These textures can influence how colors are perceived and should be considered when selecting your palette. For example, a deep red might appear even richer on a velvet sofa, while the same color could take on a more subdued tone when applied to a matte wall finish. Integration with Architectural Elements Finally, the historical accuracy of your color palette should harmonize with the architectural elements of your home. Period-specific architectural features, such as crown moldings, wainscoting, and hardwood floors, can greatly influence how colors interact with the space. Selecting colors that complement these features can enhance their beauty and the overall cohesion of your decor. For instance, a room with dark wood paneling might benefit from lighter contrasting wall colors to highlight the wood's richness without making the space feel too dark. Embracing historical accuracy in your traditional decor color palette is a journey through time, requiring careful research, an understanding of period-specific aesthetics, and a thoughtful integration of color with texture and architecture. By honoring the past in this way, you create a living space that is not only historically resonant but also deeply personal and inviting, a true testament to the enduring beauty of traditional decor. The cornerstone of traditional decor lies in its ability to evoke a sense of depth and warmth, transforming spaces into rich, inviting havens. This aesthetic is achieved not merely through the selection of colors, but by layering hues and textures in a way that adds dimension and coziness to each room. Here's how to masterfully prioritize depth and warmth in your traditional decor color palette. Selecting colors with rich undertones. When choosing colors for your traditional decor, Opt for those with rich undertones that add a sense of depth and complexity to the space. Deep jewel tones like sapphire blue, ruby red, and emerald green not only imbue spaces with a regal elegance but also create a backdrop of warmth. These colors, when applied to walls or key furniture pieces, act as anchor points in the room, drawing in the eye and enveloping the space in comfort. Incorporating earthy hues. 
Earthy hues play a pivotal role in traditional decor, grounding the space with their natural warmth. Colors inspired by nature, such as terracotta, ochre, and moss green, lend a timeless quality to interiors. These hues work harmoniously with wood and stone, materials often found in traditional designs, enhancing their natural beauty and bringing an organic warmth to your home. Integrating these earthy tones through walls, textiles, or accessory pieces can add a layer of depth that is both visually appealing and emotionally comforting. Layering for Luxurious Depth The art of layering is essential in creating depth and warmth within traditional decor. This involves more than just combining different colors, it's about creating a rich tapestry of textures, patterns, and materials. Use a variety of fabrics like silk, velvet, and brocade in your upholstery, window treatments, and throw pillows to introduce a tactile dimension to your color palette. Rugs and tapestries can add another layer of color and texture, further enhancing the sense of depth in the space. Lighting's role in warmth. Lighting plays a crucial role in enhancing the warmth and depth of your traditional decor. Soft, ambient lighting can accentuate the richness of your chosen colors, casting a warm glow that highlights textures and creates an inviting atmosphere. Incorporate a mix of light sources, such as table lamps with warm-toned shades, dimmable overhead fixtures, and candles, to add to the room's warmth and depth. The play of light and shadow can bring out the nuances in your color palette, adding a dynamic and cozy feel to the space. Accentuating with metallics. Metallic accents in gold, bronze, or copper can introduce an additional layer of depth and warmth to your traditional decor. These reflective surfaces catch light and add a touch of luxury and sophistication. Whether through frames, lighting fixtures, decorative objects, or hardware, metallics can serve as the perfect complement to the rich, warm tones of your palette. They not only brighten the space, but also create points of interest that draw the eye and add to the overall depth of the design. Emotionally engaging colors. Lastly, prioritizing depth and warmth is about choosing colors that resonate on an emotional level. Warm tones have the power to make a space feel more intimate and welcoming, creating a sanctuary that feels both luxurious and comforting. Consider how each color in your palette makes you feel and how it contributes to the desired atmosphere in your home. By selecting hues that evoke a sense of tranquility, nostalgia, or joy, you infuse your space with a warmth that goes beyond the visual, making your home a true reflection of traditional elegance and comfort. By meticulously selecting colors with rich undertones, Incorporating earthy hues, layering textures and patterns, utilizing strategic lighting, accentuating with metallics, and choosing emotionally engaging colors. You can achieve a level of depth and warmth that is the hallmark of traditional decor. This approach ensures your home is not only visually stunning but also a warm, inviting refuge that celebrates the richness of traditional design. The integration of wood tones into your traditional decor color palette is not just a nod to the natural world, but a strategic design choice that adds warmth, texture, and depth to your home. Wood, with its inherent richness and variety, can serve as a grounding element, bringing coherence and warmth to the traditional aesthetic. Here's how to skillfully incorporate wood tones into your decor. Understanding wood's natural palette. Wood comes in a spectrum of colors and grains, from the light, airy hues of maple and birch to the warm mid-tones of oak and cherry, down to the deep, dark shades of walnut and mahogany. Each type of wood brings its own character and warmth to a space, influencing the overall mood and style. Begin by taking stock of the wood elements already present in your home, flooring, furniture, beams, or architectural details, and consider how these tones can serve as a basis for your color palette. Harmonizing wood with color. To create a harmonious look, Select colors that complement the primary wood tones in your space. For lighter woods, consider soft, neutral colors or pastel shades that can highlight the wood's natural brightness without overpowering it. Mid-tone woods pair beautifully with rich, earthy colors or classic blues and greens, which can enhance the wood's warmth. Dark woods, on the other hand, offer a striking contrast against light, creamy colors or sophisticated jewel tones, making the wood's rich hues stand out. Mixing with tones. The traditional decor allows for the mixing of different wood tones, adding depth and interest to a room. The key to successfully mixing woods is to maintain a balance between warm and cool tones. Use a dominant wood tone as your base, and introduce one or two contrasting wood tones as accents. For example, a room with predominantly dark wood furniture can be brightened with lighter wood accessories or picture frames. Ensure there's a common element, 
like a similar finish or undertone, to tie the different woods together cohesively. Textural contrast and cohesion. Beyond color, the texture of the wood plays a significant role in your decor. Different finishes, from glossy to matte, can affect how the wood interacts with light and color in your space. A high-gloss finish on dark wood can add a level of sophistication and reflectivity, while a hand-scraped or matte finish on light wood can create a more casual, rustic feel. Balancing these textures with your color palette enhances the overall warmth and depth of the room, accentuating wood's natural beauty. Accent colors and decorative elements can further highlight the natural beauty of wood. Consider using metal accents like brass or copper alongside wood to add a touch of elegance and warmth. Similarly, incorporating greenery or floral patterns can complement the organic qualities of wood, making the space feel more vibrant and alive. These accents should harmonize with both the wood tones and your chosen color palette, creating a cohesive and inviting traditional decor, reflecting light and enhancing warmth. The interplay between light and wood tones can significantly impact the ambience of a room. Natural light can enhance the warmth and color of wood, making spaces feel more open and welcoming. Consider the placement of windows, mirrors, and lighting fixtures to maximize the reflection of natural light, which can make the wood tones appear richer and more vibrant. Soft, indirect lighting can also highlight the texture and color variations in wood, adding to the cozy warmth of traditional decor. Incorporating wood tones into your traditional decor color palette is a multifaceted approach that involves understanding wood's natural characteristics, harmonizing these tones with your chosen colors, mixing different wood textures and finishes, and using accent elements to enhance the wood's beauty. Through thoughtful consideration of these aspects, wood becomes not just a material in your home but a central feature of your traditional decor, imbuing your space with warmth, depth, and a sense of timeless elegance. Leveraging patterns as guides for selecting your traditional decor color palette offers a sophisticated approach to harmonizing colors in your home. Patterns, whether found in upholstery, drapery, rugs, or wallpaper, can serve as a rich source of inspiration, embodying a blend of colors that inherently work well together. This method not only ensures aesthetic cohesion, but also adds depth and interest to your spaces. Here's how to effectively use patterns as color guides in your traditional decor. Identifying dominant and accent colors and patterns. Begin by selecting a pattern that resonates with the traditional aesthetic you aim to achieve. This could be a classic floral print, a paisley design, toile, or even a more geometric or damask pattern. Examine the pattern closely to identify the dominant colors that stand out, as these will form the basis of your color palette. Equally important are the accent colors within the pattern. These can be used to add depth and variety to your decor, serving as perfect candidates for accessories, accents, and secondary furnishings, creating a color hierarchy. Once you have identified the dominant and accent colors in your chosen pattern, establish a hierarchy of how these colors will be used throughout the space. The most prevalent color in the pattern should serve as either the wall color or the main color for large furniture pieces. Secondary colors can be used in upholstery, window treatments, and rugs. Accent colors are ideal for decorative accessories, artworks, and smaller elements that can be easily changed out. This hierarchy ensures that the pattern inspires the entire room without overwhelming it. Balancing patterns and solids. While patterns are invaluable in guiding your color choices, balancing them with solid colors is crucial to avoid visual clutter. Use solid colors drawn from your pattern for larger pieces or areas in the room to create areas of visual rest. For instance, if your pattern features deep blues and greens with accents of gold, a solid navy or forest green sofa could anchor the room, while gold decorative accents add highlights. This balance ensures that the pattern enhances rather than dominates the decor. Mixing patterns with care. In traditional decor, mixing patterns is encouraged, but it requires a thoughtful approach to maintain cohesion. When incorporating multiple patterns, ensure they share a common color scheme inspired by your initial pattern guide. Varying the scale of the patterns is also key. Combine larger prints with smaller ones and stripes with florals to create visual interest without competition. This layered approach to patterns enriches the traditional aesthetic, adding complexity and depth to the space. Transitioning between spaces. Patterns can also guide the color palette across different rooms in your home, creating a cohesive flow. Use the same pattern in varying scales or different patterns within the same color family to link spaces. This technique allows each room to have its unique identity while maintaining a sense of unity throughout the home. For example, 
a bold floral pattern in the living room can transition into a more subdued floral motif in the dining room, with color palettes in both spaces drawing from the same source, reflecting mood and atmosphere. Finally, the colors and patterns you choose significantly impact the mood and atmosphere of your space. Traditional patterns often have a timeless elegance that can convey a sense of comfort and sophistication. Consider the emotional effect of your chosen pattern and its colors. Warm tones and rich patterns can make a space feel cozy and inviting, while cooler tones and delicate patterns might create a serene and calming environment. Let the desired mood of each room guide your pattern and color selections, ensuring that your home is not only visually appealing but also emotionally resonant. Using patterns as color guides in traditional decor is a nuanced process that involves identifying and prioritizing colors within patterns, balancing patterns with solids, carefully mixing different patterns, ensuring a smooth transition between spaces, and considering the emotional impact of these choices. This approach allows for a layered, sophisticated, and cohesive design that truly captures the essence of traditional decor. In the vibrant tapestry of traditional decor, neutrals play an indispensable role, acting as the canvas that allows the rich textures, deep colors, and intricate patterns to stand out. Far from being mere background shades, neutrals bring balance, depth, and sophistication to a space, ensuring that the overall aesthetic remains elegant and not overwhelming. Here's an in-depth look at how to effectively balance your traditional decor with neutrals. Understanding the Spectrum of Neutrals Neutrals encompass a wide range of colors, from crisp whites and soft ivories to rich beiges, taupes, and grays. Each shade has its own undertone and can lean warm or cool, affecting the atmosphere and mood of a room. In traditional decor, selecting the right neutral is crucial. It should complement the other colors in the palette, enhancing the warmth or providing a calming balance to richer hues. Understanding the nuances of different neutrals allows you to choose the best base or accent color for your space. Creating a foundation with neutrals. Use neutrals to create a foundation for your decor. This can be achieved through wall colors, large area rugs, or significant pieces of furniture. A neutral foundation provides flexibility, allowing you to layer colors and patterns without the risk of the space becoming too busy. For instance, a room with beige walls and a taupe sofa becomes a versatile backdrop for adding vibrant throw pillows, richly colored drapes, or an ornate patterned rug. This foundational use of neutrals ensures that the space remains grounded and cohesive, enhancing textures with neutrals. The beauty of neutrals lies in their ability to enhance textures within a space. Traditional decor, with its emphasis on materials like wood, metal, and fabric, benefits greatly from the subtlety of neutrals. A neutral palette highlights the grain of wood furniture, the gloss of metal finishes, and the weave of fabrics, adding depth and interest to the room. Incorporate a mix of textures in your neutral elements to create a rich sensory experience that complements the more vibrant aspects of your decor. Contrasting and Highlighting Neutrals are perfect for creating contrast and highlighting architectural features or key pieces within a room. Use lighter neutrals to highlight moldings, mantles, or paneling against a backdrop of richer colors. Conversely, a dark neutral can draw attention to a light-colored piece of furniture or artwork, making it a focal point. This strategic use of neutrals not only enhances the individual elements but also adds dimension to the overall space. Transitioning Spaces with Neutrals In a home with a traditional decor theme, neutrals can serve as a thread that ties different spaces together, ensuring a seamless transition from room to room. By maintaining a consistent neutral tone in the flooring, trim, or hallway walls, you create a sense of unity throughout the home. This doesn't mean every room must be painted the same neutral shade. Rather, it's about using neutrals as a consistent element that supports the flow of the overall design. Adapting to changing styles. One of the greatest advantages of balancing your traditional decor with neutrals is the flexibility it offers. Neutrals provide a timeless backdrop that can adapt to changes in style, trends, or personal preferences. Whether you decide to update your color scheme, switch out accessories, or incorporate new art, a neutral base ensures that these changes can be made easily without requiring a complete overhaul of your decor. Incorporating neutrals into your traditional decor is a nuanced art that involves understanding the spectrum of neutral shades, using neutrals to create a balanced foundation, enhancing textures, creating contrast and highlights, ensuring smooth transitions between spaces, and providing flexibility for future updates.
By masterfully balancing with neutrals, you ensure that your traditional decor remains both elegant and adaptable, creating a space that is timeless, inviting, and deeply personal. Incorporating metallic accents into your traditional decor is a sophisticated strategy to infuse your home with a layer of elegance, luxury, and visual interest. Metals, with their reflective qualities and rich textures, can complement the depth and warmth of traditional color palettes, adding a dynamic contrast to the softer, more matte finishes of fabrics and woods. Here's how to expertly weave metallic accents into your traditional decor. Choosing the right metals. The first step in adding metallic accents is selecting the type of metal that best complements your existing decor. Traditional interiors often benefit from the warm tones of gold, brass, and copper, which enhance the richness of classic color schemes. Silver, pewter, and chrome, with their cooler tones, can offer a crisp, elegant contrast to warmer hues, adding a refreshing lift to the space. Consider the overall tone of your room and the colors you've used to determine which metals will harmonize best with your design. Strategic Placement for Maximum Impact Metallic accents are most effective when used strategically throughout a space. Their placement should be intentional, aiming to draw the eye and create focal points without overwhelming the senses. Consider adding metallics in areas where they can catch the light, such as near windows or lamps. Mirrors with ornate metallic frames, metal light fixtures, and decorative objects on mantles or shelves can serve as points of interest that enhance the room's overall appeal. Mixing Metals with Care in traditional decor, mixing different metals can add depth and complexity to your design. However, this should be done with care to maintain a cohesive look. A good rule of thumb is to choose one dominant metal tone and one or two accent metals to avoid a disjointed appearance. Ensure there is a common element or theme that ties the different metals together, such as a similar finish or design style. For instance, combining brushed gold cabinet handles with a polished brass chandelier can create a harmonious balance if both share a classical design element. Balance and Proportion While metallics can add a touch of glamour to traditional decor, it's important to balance their use to ensure they complement rather than dominate the space. Use metallics as accents rather than primary elements, distributing them evenly throughout the room to avoid creating an overly metallic or cold atmosphere. The goal is to achieve a subtle shimmer that enhances the warmth and richness of the traditional palette, not to overshadow it. Incorporating metallics in textiles and wallpapers. Metallics need not be limited to hard surfaces and fixtures. Incorporating metallic threads in textiles or metallic patterns in wallpapers can add an unexpected layer of texture and reflectivity to your traditional decor. Look for fabrics and wallpapers with gold, silver, or bronze accents woven into classic patterns. These can be used for throw pillows, drapery, or accent walls, adding a soft glow and a touch of luxury to the space. The Role of Metallics in Traditional Themes Metallic accents can play a significant role in emphasizing the historical and cultural themes inherent in traditional decor. For example, gold and brass elements can evoke the opulence of Baroque or Renaissance interiors, while silver and pewter accents might reflect the understated elegance of colonial or Georgian styles. Choose metallic accents that resonate with the specific era or style you wish to evoke, enhancing the authenticity and depth of your traditional decor. Incorporating metallic accents into traditional decor is a nuanced art that involves selecting the right metals, strategic placement, careful mixing of different metals, maintaining balance and proportion. Incorporating metallics in textiles and wallpapers, and aligning with traditional themes. By thoughtfully integrating metallic elements, you can elevate your traditional decor adding layers of elegance, warmth, and historical depth that enrich the overall ambience of your home. When curating a traditional decor color palette for your home, the emotional impact of your chosen colors transcends mere aesthetic considerations, reaching into the heart of how spaces feel and influence well-being. Colors have the power to evoke memories, alter mood, and shape the atmosphere of a room, making the emotional resonance of your palette a critical aspect of traditional decor. Here's a deeper exploration of how to consider the emotional impact in your design. Understanding Color Psychology Begin with a foundational understanding of color psychology and how different hues can affect emotions and behaviors. Warm colors like reds, oranges, and yellows can evoke feelings of warmth, comfort, and energy, making them ideal for communal spaces like living rooms and dining areas. On the other hand, cool colors such as blues, greens, and purples tend to create a calming and soothing effect, 
perfect for bedrooms and bathrooms where relaxation is key. Incorporating these insights into your traditional decor can help create environments that foster the desired emotional responses. Historical and Cultural Significance The emotional impact of colors can also be influenced by their historical and cultural significance. For instance, certain shades of blue may evoke a sense of tranquility and serenity, reminiscent of historical homes by the sea, while deep reds and golds can convey a sense of opulence and luxury, echoing the grandeur of historic estates and palaces. Consider the historical narratives and cultural associations of your chosen colors and how they can enrich the emotional depth and storytelling of your space. Personal Connections and Memories Personal experiences and memories significantly influence how we perceive color. A particular shade of green might remind one person of a cherished landscape, invoking a sense of peace, while the same shade might feel refreshing and invigorating to someone else. When selecting colors for your traditional decor, reflect on the personal connections and memories associated with those hues. Integrating colors that hold special meaning can make your home not only visually appealing, but also emotionally resonant and uniquely yours. Creating a Harmonious Balance Achieving a harmonious balance within your traditional decor involves more than just balancing warm and cool tones. It's about creating a seamless flow of energy and emotion throughout the home. This balance ensures that transitioning from room to room feels natural and comforting. For instance, a vibrant, warm-colored living room that transitions into a cool, serene bedroom should do so in a way that feels intuitive, using transitional colors or decor elements that gently guide the emotional shift. Color Intensity and Saturation The intensity and saturation of colors also play a crucial role in their emotional impact. Bright, saturated colors can energize a space and its inhabitants, while muted tones tend to soothe and calm. In traditional decor, where depth and richness are key, choosing the right saturation level can enhance the emotional atmosphere of a room. A dining room might feature a rich, deep blue to foster intimate, engaging conversations, while a study may use a muted green to encourage concentration and calm. Adaptive and Seasonal Considerations Consider how the emotional impact of colors can change with the seasons or over time. Using textiles, accessories, and art, you can adapt the emotional tone of your rooms to suit the season or your current mood. Light, airy colors might bring a sense of renewal in spring, while warm, earthy tones can make a space feel cozy and inviting in the fall. This adaptability allows your traditional decor to evolve, keeping the emotional connections fresh and relevant. Incorporating the emotional impact into your traditional decor color palette requires a thoughtful blend of color psychology, historical and cultural significance, personal connections, harmonious balance, careful consideration of color intensity, and adaptability to seasonal changes. By deeply engaging with the emotional dimensions of color, you create not just a visually stunning home, but a sanctuary that resonates with the hearts and minds of those who inhabit it, embodying the true essence of traditional decor.